I'm David Henry. I play Justin Russo on Wizards Beyond Waverly Place, and you're watching Entertainment Tonight. Oh boy, here we go. This is where it all started. We're home. Not only do we have you back, which is such a treat, to have Selena back on the show for a couple episodes and as an executive producer. I need you to keep it real with me. Any tears shed? Oh yeah, yeah. I'm check it out. All right, here we go. In the pilot specifically, there's some very heartfelt moments with the two of us where um, her and I were just moved and yeah, I got a tear, tear, lump in my throat, tear in my eye. What can you tell me about seeing her back in her Alex clothes, embodying that beloved character again? It was so cool. Like, like for instance, the moment before we, we did our first scene, you know, she's back in her wardrobe, I'm in mine. We got it, we're full hair and makeup, we're about to go. And, um, and they're about to say action. We just looked at each other and it was, the second action was said, there was no rust at all. It was like, we both got back on the bike and we were, the, the chemistry was there. The um, timing was there. No timing had passed, it was magic immediately. It was so cool. And we, she, we, we both finished and we we're both like, yeah, we still got it. Well, you know, everything's gonna be a breeze. Wizards of Waverly Place aired 106 episodes over four seasons. In 2010, the show won an Emmy, and the last episode in 2012 was, at the time, the most watched series finale ever on the Disney Channel. Of course, you're back, Selena's back. The OG fans want to know, what's the status of someone like a Jake T. Austin or a Bridget Mendler? Are we going to get more OGs besides the two of you? Yes, absolutely. We're going to get more OGs. We want all the OGs. We want the whole alphabet of, of <laughs> in, in our show. So um, David DeLuise came on, our dad, um, uh, Jer Jerry Russo. We're definitely going to get um, Maria Canales Barrera, who played our mother in the show, Teresa, back. Um, we want everyone back. So yes, it's, it's, it's just a matter of time before we, we get everyone on the show. Um, J uh, Jennifer Stone, Harper, we want everyone back. What's that? A hat? Crazy, funky, junky hat, overslept, hair inside trying to look like Kira Knightley. You told me at the Reagan premiere, not only having her on set, you've had Benny on set. Oh yeah. I know you're a proud big brother. Yes. Does Benny get your stamp of approval? I tell you what, we had dinner the other night, and I love the guy. We really? we had a blast. I see the way Selena looks at him. I see that she's happy, and that makes me happy at the end of the day. Are you going to give him a role at this point? Oh, you know, we should talk about that. We should talk about that. That would actually be very funny. We should do something he would be very uncomfortable with. He's a chef, too. He likes to cook food, so we got to do something with that, but, like, the opposite of what he would want. Like, make him really uncomfortable. Surprise! What are you doing here, Alex? I don't teach wizards anymore. But don't you miss it? No, I don't even think about it every day. Fans love Selena and David's on-screen sibling banter. And in the new iteration, Selena, AKA Alex, surprises her big bro with a young wizard in need of training. Billy is rebellious and stubborn, sarcastic. Sounds like someone else I know. Ha ha, like me, I get it. The casting process was a blast, you know, because this this new girl, Billy, um, her character's name is Billy, was a, a, a big character to, to fill. We found the girl, um, Janice, who's absolutely incredible. We found her, and I remember bringing the tape to Selena and showing it to her, and Selena just watched it. She got this big smile on her face, and she was like, that's the girl. That's the girl. She's got it. I'm just, like, so grateful, again, to be in this position. Like, it just really goes to prove, as long as you put the work in, then you will get what you desire. Us rebels, we gotta stick together. Now you get to work with Selena Gomez. Is that like a pinch me bucket list moment? What has that experience been like? It has been truly a dream. She's just so sweet. Like she's like the best scene partner ever. Like honestly, so I at first I was super nervous about meeting her, but like she's just like so beautiful. She's so beautiful and like side and smile. out. Yes. Yes, and like her smile just, I feel like it can just light up a room. Everything is not what it seems. You get to sing the theme song to Wizards Beyond Waverly Place. It's not just Janice, it's also Selena. Getting to collaborate with her on such an iconic song, what's that like for you? I was like so nervous. I was like, am I gonna sound right with her? And then I like, it just fit. I was like, 
Oh my goodness. Billy moves in with Justin, played by David, plus his wife and two sons on the show, and the young actors were pinching themselves on set. It's just so exciting to be in a show where like David Henry's your dad and Selena Gomez is your aunt. It's just been so amazing. They're, they've made me a better actor. David has been such a, a mentor for me, giving me bits of advice, and because my character is so much like him, I get, to, I get to see things that he does and bring them back into my character, so you really get that father-son kind of thing. You say that both David and Selena have really set the tone for this set. In what ways have they done that? They took us all out to dinner. We did a big cast dinner. It was like family dinner before we started shooting and it was really nice for all of us, the kids, to get to know everybody and they were able to tell us stories of the original show and the things that they wanted to really take with them to this to this show. Who remembers the original Wizards of Waverly Place? We wanted to recreate that magic again for a new generation. The first time you walked onto this set. What was your reaction like? It was it was crazy. It was like walking into a dream, but it's reality. You're hit with so many feelings. The school set, it's a different one than, than the original show, but right when I walked on, my brain instantly went, where's my locker? Thinking I'm a kid. And I was like, no, I'm the principal of the school. You're old enough to be the principal now. Well, I'm, I am the principal, like this is crazy. This takes me back. I don't know what any of this stuff is, but I love it. You have essentially recreated the lair. Can you please give me a tour? And yes, and this is this is built like to the inch. Th these chairs here, this little yeah. love seat, that captain chair right there, that this is all from the original show. I remember the first time I walked in here, I was like, my I spent years in this room. Selena and I would sleep on these couches, <laughs> you know, during lunch or whatever, and um, and we're back now. This is one of the portals that also takes us to our house. Please look at the portal. So we walk through this mirror and it morphs into our living room set. Hey kid, is this the Russo house? So here we are in the Russo living room. Yes, so it was very important to us when we were designing this set to have an iconic couch. Because if you remember in the original show, uh, we had this wonderful orange couch that was very memorable. Mm -hmm. And on all sitcoms, the couch is a big deal. You spend a lot of big time deal. on your family room couch. So we wanted something colorful that nodded to the original, but that was its own thing. So we found this wonderful, what would you say that is, burnt yellow or? Mustard. Mustardy. Yeah, yeah we found it. Yeah, because you're yellow. I'm yellow. This, this is, is mustard. mustard. We wanted a staircase too to pay homage to the original show, so we got a staircase there. That's, that, that's where we go to the lair. So this is our kitchen, where we spend a lot of time cooking and eating. Fun fact, uh, all of our, um, Pots and pans are Selena Gomez edition from uh, our place. Yeah, these are all Selena pot and pans. Different than Alex Russo, a very different person. But um, Alex loves Selena's products. We're now here in your school. What is this school called? So the school's name is homage to the creator of the show, Todd Greenwald, of the original show. So this is Greenwald, um, Greenwald Middle School. Oh, that's so sweet. And look at how good our set deck is. All of these lockers have stuff, all of them. David, this was so cool. Thank you for all the behind the scenes nuggets. By the way, I just heard off camera that you have to get back to the studio, so let me help you. <sighs> all right guys, later. I gotta get back to work too.